So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today guys I bring you quite possibly the rarest weapon in the game. If not, it's definitely one of them. It has a 0.5% drop chance rate from a certain few set of enemies you can find on the map. So yes guys, it is quite rare. How's it going people? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leave a like, it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so the weapon is the Noble Slender Sword. Now, I will admit um, a pal of mine dropped on my stream yesterday and actually mentioned this to me. His name is Mill Gaming. Uh, he actually covered this, I believe, yesterday too. Uh, but if you do want to check him out and show him some love, you'll find his channel link down below. But yeah, guys, a Noble Slender Sword. As you can see, it scales with that strength and that dexterity with a B scaling within that dex. I mean, I think it does go up to an A with the Asher Wars, as you know. Uh, required uh, Attributes required are a 8 in strength and a 11 in dexterity. Let me just quickly check that, actually, guys. I probably should have done this before I started recording, but hey, it is what it is. It is what it is. Okay, so let's quickly just... Um, okay, so it's a B. Also, it goes at A, scaling dexterity, not strength. I don't know what I said, but yeah. So not bad, not bad could be your kind of thing people could be your kind of thing so to get this thing like i said it's a 0.5 percent drop chance at a hundred discovery so if your discovery is like mine at 250 it's well, like a 2.5 percent increases it i'm not sure my math's pretty bad but who cares but either way 100 uh, discovery it's a 0.5 percent drop chance from a certain set few enemies we will farm now like i said there's a few of these on the map but the best spot i've found is right here really waypoint ruin cellar this is where you meet sorcerer selling within here uh, i'm way past that point but this is the grace point we will use to farm this thing now if you haven't got this grace point come here guys this area right here come down into the cellar into the waypoint ruins come down here guys activate this grace point because there's actually where the enemies are following a carriage that's being pulled by two giants along this road and this is the best grace point to actually use to farm them so from this grace point guys we can actually fast travel back to it because actually you can time this perfectly so they're literally right outside of the waypoint if you just quickly fast travel to the grace now have i got my weapon on yes i have so i'm just going to quickly run outside of this put my light on so you guys can see what i'm doing and you'll see these enemies so you come up here guys just turn left go through this door or this this gap and you'll see them here now you can kill the giants if you want is it easy to kill uh, but you'll see the actual ads carrying this sword bop, bop, bop. There's one of them. There's, there's quite a few of them here actually, to be honest. So I think it could be three or four. So I'll use a weapon which has got a decent air of effect damage. I mean, these guys hit soft. So yeah, if you're high enough for level, you'll take them all like one hit. That kind of horseback wants to stop hitting them. Just like so, guys. Very easy, very easy indeed. Are you just gonna give up now? There we go. How much you've killed them all? Pick up that loot and get rid of these guys too. Let's get them out of the way. Pick up the loot and hope for the best. Uh, it's quite a lot of um, I love so much shit here. I've been farm actually farm for probably about two and a half hours to get this, so it's quite a rare drop rate. Even like I've got 250 discovery. Um, that is because I've got a few buffs on as well. By the way, to buff that discovery, I have on. I have on the silver tier mask, and I'm also using the silver scarab as well. So that's a bit of a increase to that discovery for me. And then guys, what I'll do then is just simply go back to the grace point and then run straight back here. And it really is that simple. Just do this over and over until you get this uh, weapon. I mean, it's nothing great. It's not incredible. But if you're a collector like me and you want to collect everything, then this is what you got to do, people. This is what you got to do. But hey, I'm guessing someone out there will uh, enjoy this weapon. But that's what I'm here for. That's what these guys are for. It's a showcase to you uh, where to get certain things. Uh, it's up to you how you use them and if you use them. Simple as that. All right, mate. You can see me. Come follow me this way. There we go. That's a bit better. Not that the guy on the horse is still getting me. Pain in the ass. Bop, bop, boom. Simple as that, guys. And I wouldn't mind a second one. I'm not going to lie. I wouldn't mind a second one. But yeah, my luck is just bad. <laughs> my luck is just bad. And like I said, this is just such a rare drop as well give me that weapon boy give me that weapon but yeah guys 
that's how you get this thing, that's how you farm this thing. And like I said, if it's, if it's something you're interested in, do what you gotta do. Now you can actually kill these giants and get something out of here. I can't remember what's in there. But yeah, there's definitely a weapon in there too. But guys, there we have it. This is how you get the actual super rare Noble Slender Sword. You can get this from basically the start of the game as well, by the way. So yes, there we have it. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more out of me, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully my beautiful people, I will see you on that next one.